Hey guys, I'm challenging myself today by trying to explain bones in 60 seconds. So, bones, what are they? They're obviously in the body. Uh, we have about three to four kilos of bone in the human body. And fascinatingly, that is able to withstand our entire body weight. So, that's awesome. Now, what's gonna happen with resistance training is heavy and dynamic loads are gonna increase your bone mineral density, which is basically the content in the bone that makes them stronger. So that is, of course, a good adaptation. And now what's gonna happen is the cortical layer of the bone is actually going to increase. Uh, we're gonna get an extra layer. Uh, the cortical layer is the very outside layer of the bone, right? And this cortical bone is cylinder. So it actually encompasses the whole bone in a cylinder shape. Now, that's fantastic because take the toilet paper, right? Very small, thin, literally thin as cardboard piece, right? Now, cylinders are naturally strong in nature. Now, look at this. We've got five full uh, karaoke mixes full of CDs. Very heavy, by the way, uh, in, con in regards to the cardboard. And look, it's able to withstand that load easily. And that's the same as our bones with our body weight. And now if you think about increasing this diameter by even half a millimeter, that would make this toilet paper roll drastically stronger. And that's the exact same as bones in our body and the cortical layers that increase with resistance training. Thank you.